Meryl Streep was once described as a cross between a den mother and a class cut-up. Uh, I don't know who that was, but... <laughs> when a reporter asked Clint Eastwood why he chose Meryl to star opposite him in The Bridges of Madison County, he shrugged and replied, she's the greatest actor in the world. At 15, Meryl won the role of Mary and the Librarian, there's a theme here, uh, in her high school's production of The Music Man following the footsteps of her idol, Barbara Cook. That led to Yale Drama School and then to Hollywood, where Meryl won two Oscars in four years. And then she turned 38, <laughs> long, which uh, in Washington, at least, uh, according to Meryl, uh, is the uh, sell-by date for Hollywood actresses. <laughs> and she remembers turning to her husband, Don, and saying, well, it's over. Uh, luckily, it, it was not over. Since then, Merrill has tackled incredibly complex roles, ranging from Julia Child uh, to most recently Margaret Thatcher. Today, she's the most nominated actress in the history of the Academy Awards. She's tossed aside more than a few stereotypes along the way. Uh, each of her roles is different, and different from what we expect Meryl Streep to be. As she says, I picked the weirdest little group of personalities but I think they've all deserved to have a life. For giving life to those characters and joy to so many of us, let's give Meryl Streep a round of applause. <laughs>